have my tax, I couldn't show everything I would take, uh, we would take on our bicycle holiday, but, yeah, it's just like I would take a diary of me, of course, a paper diary, and, uh, yeah, some other stuff he would obviously take on a camping trip. Uh, yeah, bye-bye. I've got everything I need for this holiday. Bye. Let me carry all the stuff uh, I'm quite certain I'm going to take with me. Right there is the main, <laughs> and the main bag containing a kitchen. Uh, let's see what's going on That's interesting. Uh, clothing that will be taken as well. This is quite interesting, except it's stuff that I've worn so long. Yeah, I don't want to replace me um, same thing, but so uh, bed size stuff. Bed room. Sports tent itself, which was right there, special bag and <laughs> sleeping bags. This is for quite some time, and they're very well in this kind of summer to keep the heat a little bit out. We've got some sleeping mats. These were actually a re relatively recent acquisition compared to the uh, clothing, the kitchen stuff, which I'm going to show later, and the tent. Uh, it, it, we bought this around when we went to Dassel uh, for a bit of island hopping. I actually went to Amelons and we've bought these. Uh, we've got the first pair we've got was specifically. Uh, before that we had a, a larger air bed with a separate pump that took too much room, it's a much smaller one two of them right there as well uh, with a built-in pump but that one uh, unfortunately uh, it actually just bulged out in the centre of both of them and we had to return them to stall for warranty and we've got these instead right now pyjamas Huh. These are empty cushion uh, sacks or something like that. We would put uh, clothing, jacket, stuff like that in. Spare. And it's a very interesting book uh, type. It's not the content that's interesting, it's the type of books. And the Netherlands is called a diverse liquor. And these are very small, very lightweight books that you could take with you. I think some countries should call these pocket books or something like that. But okay, let's go back here. Show you something very, very interesting uh, that we're going to take with us, which is this 9C9 game set. Uh, no, a very more interesting thing. It contains nine and games, but it just contains three elements: the dice, a uh, playing board with the uh, characters, as well as damning uh, checkers, as it's typically called. But there is a sheet in it, of scoreboard and a manual. That shows all the variants of games that could be played during using just these three. We had anything other than a typical Dutch uh, cycling card game in here as well. Nothing to play down by plastics to keep stuff from messing around. Uh, yeah, it's stuff I would want to show. And I'll already show you these pair uh, little. SC card, uh, I mean a spare battery, and a uh, SC card reader, I mean, spare battery, quite a lot of stuff going on, and right in, right there, this is, so yeah, we're going to go tomorrow, my first day, uh, but, there is something I didn't show last time was the uh, 
bicycle hold that is easy. So I have a little video on this one. It's quite wobbly. I, my bicycle has been checked by a repair shop and they have uh, replaced the tires and just as well, I think. So it could be a bit more so. It could be. It, I don't know if it will be. <laughs> right there, the uh, clamp for my smartphone just in case. And. I'm also possibly I'll to take this camera with me uh, or at least I'll make some videos with my uh, smartphone <laughs> I'll see you then, bye I hope you've enjoyed this video, if you do please give a thumbs up and share this video with all your friends and perhaps consider subscribing to my channel thank you and I'll see you next time